do you have a test that's coming up really soon and you haven't started studying for it and you're pretty sure you're going to fail? Well, even if you don't, you should keep watching because I'm going to give y'all some A1 last minute study tips. Period. It's JC and I'm back with another video. Hey guys, it's JC and I'm back with another video and currently I have a test tomorrow, less than 24 hours and I haven't studied at all for it and it's the end of the unit test so it's pretty important and I actually consider myself a pro at preparing for tests like this so I thought why not share these tips with you so that is exactly what I'm about to do. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So the first thing you want to do is eliminate distractions and you can simply do this by turning your phone on do not disturb. So next you want to find yourself a good playlist to listen to while studying. So some people work best when they're listening to music with words. So you can do that by going on the Spotify and if you like to hear some of my music, you can follow me on Spotify. It is right there on the screen. If music with words doesn't work for you, you can also try lofi music. And lofi music is basically like chill beats with no words, and I personally like it very much. And you can find it on YouTube. If you haven't heard of it already, Quizlet is a great tool to use. Quizlet is like an online flash card software and it's also an app that you can get on your phone and on quizlet there are many different features but my favorite features are learn test and matching with these features i am able to quickly learn all the material that i need to know for my test If your school gave you a textbook for your class, make sure to use it. One way you can do this is by writing down the main points in a chapter. Also, most chapters have key points that you need to know at the end of the chapter, so make sure that you know all of these points because that's probably what will be on the test. Sometimes your notes from school can have a lot going on and it can be hard to study from them. That's why you should rewrite your notes. From rewriting your notes, you not only are able to make your notes neater, but you are also repeating your notes to yourself, causing your brain to remember them. If you would like a more in-detail video on how I write my notes, be sure to comment because I would love to make one. Sometimes you need to get off of Quizlet and make physical note cards. By making physical note cards, you are writing the information down. And writing is another way that you can remember the information easily. Do not study all your material at once. Break your time up into 15 minute sections so that you do not feel overwhelmed. Before your test, you can do a brain dump. What this means is just get a piece of paper out and write down everything you remember about your subject. This will allow you to fill in any last minute blanks and make sure that you know everything you're supposed to know. Well, that is all I have for this video. If you enjoyed, let me know by like, commenting, and subscribing. And remember, if you want that um how I take notes video, just comment down below and let me know. And if you want um, a video of just how I study in general, because this is more like last minute study tips, then you can let me know. 
and yeah if you want more school videos just let me know and don't forget to follow me on instagram and snapchat i'll have them down in the description box below and that is it for this video thank you all for watching bye bye